Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Rajane. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome my baby, okay? Click that subscribe button down below so you don't miss any of the videos and you can be a part of Rajanation. But today, you know, <laughs> at this point, I don't know where this video is gonna go, to be honest. Um, if you can't tell, my energy is a bit low. Um, literally, like, probably like two minutes ago, I just got done crying. <laughs> um, I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Life has been lifing, and I know some of y'all understand that down to a T. Okay, life has a way of just basically whooping our ass. But, you know, <laughs> I just um got out of my prayer closet after talking to god and crying because i felt like i just needed a moment to let some pain be released let some tears be released and so i know that people may not be so open and so i guess comfortable with mental health and stuff like that but mental health is important to me and i feel like it should be important to other people as well at the end of the day like people go through things and you know a lot of us are not very comfortable with talking about those things but you know there's so many people in this world that go through things behind closed doors and you never know about it because we sit here such as myself we sit here with a smile on our face and just act like everything is cool and peachy but it's just really not but i don't know like i felt like something in my spirit just wanted me to come and just set my phone up and just talk to you guys and just kind of let you guys know <laughs> what i've been going through and just how we can all just prevail um, like I said, I was crying like literally like two minutes ago. So, and I feel like I look a complete mess. So please forgive me. But, um, I've just been going through in a nutshell because I don't want to be putting so much of my business out there. <laughs> um, I don't put too much of my business, but like I have just been like, life has been lifing for me. And like, I've been going through for the longest, like, Y'all know where it's like, y'all have financial struggles and it just seems like there's like, you know, you have to pay money here, give money here, give money here, 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 and here. But it's just like, you're not even living, like, you're not even living the life that you wanna live currently. You know what I mean? Like, it's so many people with their hands out wanting money and it's like, at this point, like, you're over here working a job that's not even paying you enough to give out the money that's that you need to be putting out that you need to give people you know what i mean like y'all know what i'm talking about like we're living in a recession at this point money just prices are increasing you know what i'm saying and everybody i feel is in a position where it's just like uh -uh, like this is too expensive that is too expensive you know what i mean like i said everybody has their hand out whether it's rent bills car notes credit cards like trust me I'm feeling it but you know what I'm saying but it's just like you're over here working a job that you really don't even want <laughs> you know like you're just unhappy and you know like I said I was praying to God and it's just like there's just analogies that I've created for myself that I feel like I live by in life and this is one that just popped into my head. So I hope that it resonates with somebody. I, you know, just like me, for example, I'm not living the life that I wanna live, obviously. I feel like 90 or if 99.9% of the world really ain't living the life that they wanna live, you know what I mean? But you have to do what you have to do, you know what I mean? And sometimes that means you have to do things that you don't wanna do. And I'm not gonna lie. It's like, I know that in my mind, but I still be like, nah, but I'm still not trying to do that because this is what I wanna do. So I can be stubborn in that sense, but you know, sometimes you have to do what you don't wanna do so that at some point you can do what you wanna do. You can live the life that you wanna live. 
and that's easier said than done you know what i'm saying because it's definitely a process you know sometimes i feel like you live a life that you don't want to live or that you're so comfortable with that you forget the bigger goals that you have for yourself like the visions that you want for yourself i feel like sometimes you forget about that because you're so comfortable living like this basic life and i'm not every look everybody's version of their dream life or success you know it's different for everybody you know what i mean but it's just like if you're someone like me who wants more for themselves you know what i mean you want to live a life where like you're free and you're happy and you're successful a life of luxury okay you know it's just like you can't get comfortable <laughs> you know what i'm saying like there's got to be a time where it's just like no like i need to be on top of my ish and really get down to what is it that i want for myself and how am i going to get there and let me tell you i've never been the person that is good at planning out my life and planning out like a whole five-year plan and whatnot like that just has not been me i don't know what it is you know maybe somebody else can can help me in the comments with that because maybe you're that kind of person but i'm just i am not you know what i mean like i feel like I'm one of those people where it's just like, I may not know exactly how to get to where I'm wanting to get to, but I know where I want to get to, if that makes sense, you know, like, I'm just a visualist, I'm a dreamer, you know what I mean, like, I, since I was little, my head has always been in the clouds, just daydreaming and whatnot, what, my, what I would like my life to be like, and it's cool, you know what I'm saying, it's not to say that your life can't get to that point, or that you can never have that, but sometimes it's like you gotta think about reality you know what i mean like what are you doing right now that can get you to that place instead of just daydreaming and you know what i mean looking out the window and just huh you know it's so much more different than that like real life you really be feeling that ish you know and life don't let you forget it okay so the analogy that i was talking about is i hope resonates with somebody is that life be life in yes but i want you to understand that the place that you're in right now whether you're sitting here watching me and you're living a life that you know is full of misery you're unhappy you want more for yourself but you're not sure where to go how to start what to do life just keeps throwing things at you left and right they keep throwing punches at you left and right and you not even dodging them you taking all the hits and now you feel like you can't fight no more and i want to let you know that that dark space that you're in right now that dark place that you're in you know that storm that you're going through it's just a temporary storm i know that you know one day you're going to deal with the storm and then maybe the next day it's going to be sunny and then two days later you might have storms week long and you want to give up at that moment because you feel like you can't take any more of those dark gloomy days you know sitting in a dark place you know letting your thoughts wander and wonder and wondering why you're not where you want to be wondering why you know you're a failure wondering why you can't live this life that maybe you see other people on social media live like just in this dark negative space and thinking negative things back to back to back for a week long it's dark gloomy stuck inside your head wondering if you're ever gonna get a chance to see a sunny day i want to let you know that yes storms do come and sometimes they may come harder than others. Rain will be pouring, baby. Lightning, thunder, you're getting the whole nine, okay? And you're gonna go through those dark times and you're gonna sit in those thoughts and wonder like, why me? Does this ever get better? But I promise you, babe, <laughs> the storms are temporary. It's not gonna rain forever, okay? It's not, it's temporary okay you never know tomorrow may be the day where you'll see sun peeking through those clouds and it'll be a sunny day for you you'll be happy 
your vibes will be back to where it was supposed to be. You're going to have a smile on your face. You're going to have more positive thoughts. Like your aura and your spirit, your presence is going to be brighter than what it was yesterday. But sometimes you have to go through those storms. And it's not to say that when you go through those storms that you have to sit there and be negative and, and tear yourself down little by little. I tend to do that, yes. Especially if I'm crying at that point. If I'm crying, I might as well say the ugliest, darkest, nastiest things that I can think of myself to make myself cry even like more. But while you're going through that storm, don't give up, okay? Don't think life is over, life is done. It's over for you. There's nothing good that's gonna come out of this. No, there's good things that come out of a storm. Yeah, there could be some floods, dark clouds, dark skies, a whole bunch of rain. But understand that the next day, the sun is out. The raindrops on the grass is glistening and shining in the light. Plants are growing. Understand that that's how you grow in life. You have to get water. And sometimes, yeah, it means that you're gonna have to go through those dark times, but that's how you grow, you know? So I don't know if that made sense to anybody, but just know that the storms that you're going through in life are only temporary. And who knows? Tomorrow may be the day where you'll get a sunny day. So don't give up on yourself. When you're going through those dark times and through those storms, try to change your mindset. I don't think that people understand that a lot of times your mindset is what keeps you where you are in life. That's why you're stuck. Change your mindset. Don't see a storm as a storm or see it as a bad thing. See it as, well, tomorrow could be a better day. The sun is out. Plants is growing, flowers are growing. It's more shiny, it's, it's more sunny days ahead. That's what you have to think. But if you're going through that storm and you're thinking, oh, it's always gonna be a storm that's gonna be coming. Storms are gonna come, just know that. Prepare yourself for it, okay? But don't get down in the dumps and stay there and think that that's all that's ever is gonna happen to me. All I'm gonna get is bad luck because God has a way of blessing others. God works in mysterious ways and you have to go through those storms to see those sunny days, to see the success. So yes, you may not understand those storms now that God is putting you through, but I, I'll let me tell you something. Two weeks from now, two months from now, six months, a year from now, you're going to understand why God made you go through those different storms. Understand that. Yes, we put ourselves in situations where we set ourselves up. Let's be honest, okay? It's called awareness. You know, it's called accountability. You know, a lot of the times we put ourselves in those situations that we be like at the end of the day, oh my gosh, why is this happening to me? this is my fault and yes say that own that but also understand that life happens at times and life is gonna throw you punches but you gotta fight back you gotta fight back okay the days is not over for you better days will come but you gotta wake up the next day knowing hey i don't know today yeah it's a little rainy it's a little gloomy but who knows it could it, the sun could come out today work through those storms because that's how you become that's how you become stronger but i don't know if that made sense <laughs> hopefully it resonates with somebody i just i have so many thoughts in my mind there's probably so many things that i wanted to say but honestly this video was not planned to be honest with you like you see how i look this video was not planned i just felt like i wanted to come talk to you guys um it's october so you already know that it's i want to say it's world mental health month or something like that it's something along those lines i'm gonna put it on the screen down below but i don't know yeah i just i wanted to talk to anybody who was willing to listen anybody that's going through something in life i promise you the pain that you feel is temporary is what i was trying to say at the end of the day the sunny days are temporary, the storms are temporary, but just know both of them are gonna come. So don't think that the dark times that you're experiencing right now are gonna last forever because they're not. But you gotta be willing to change your mindset and want better for yourself and work towards that. 
and know that, yeah, I'm going through tough times right now, but it'll get better for me. Better things are coming for me. You know, I just got to keep my head up, have faith, and be thankful and grateful that God gave me the opportunity to see another day and to try again. I like the whole keep your head up Tupac reference, the try again Aaliyah reference. I love it. So, yes, um, that's all I wanted to say. Please forgive me for this random short video, but I really hope that it resonates with somebody and that, I don't know, you move forward in life. Better days are coming. I promise you, they are. Look, today is even, a, it's a sunny day today. So, yeah, guys, that's it for today. Um, yeah, even though I was crying, I already told myself that today is gonna, I still got the rest of the day to go. So, yes, I had a moment with God to cry, but that doesn't mean that the rest of my day will not be good. So, um, I'm washing clothes right now, but I'm about to go edit some videos because I got four videos to edit for y'all. Y'all already know Vlogtober is here. Fall vibes are here. So I'm giving you the content, baby. But make sure you could click. Ugh, wow. Make sure you click that subscribe button down below to be a part of Raja Nation because this is where you want to be. Okay, let's be friends. But without further ado, I'm going to see you guys later. Make sure you have a good day, have a blessed day. And remember, the bad days, the rainy days, the storms, they're only temporary. Sunny days are coming for you, okay? Work hard, keep a positive mind, and know that a better life is on the way. But be grateful for the life and that what you're experiencing, what you're grateful for today. So yeah, leave in the comments what you're grateful for. Um, love you guys.